Hey everyone, it's Lars here, and welcome back to Virtual Paddock. Today's video is basically going to be a follow up to my last video, because it turns out that I actually missed a few details about the RSS Formula Hybrid 2022. And they just released the V2 update for that car, so let's have another look. In terms of what I missed, Turns out that RSS have also animated the front wing flex, just like VRC had. But not only the front wing, there's also animated floor flex, as well as even the antenna. They've also released a video now showing some other interesting features like the sounds and optimal RPM for the styling procedures, which by the way are different for the two cars. It's 9000 RPM for the standard car and 10,800 RPM for the S, both at around 20% throttle. Now in terms of what's new in version 2, they've increased the weight for both cars, 5kg for the standard car and 10kg for the S. A bunch of the animations have been adjusted, and specifically for the CSP physics, they've now added front and rear wing fine tuning options. Whereas before, we could only adjust the overall downforce level. Unfortunately, the downforce configuration still aren't shown visually, but I'm happy to see more adjustability now. So let's quickly take it on track again and see how it drives now. Alright, so here I'm on the grid at Spa. I'm not driving the race, but I want to show the styling procedure, so around, around 9000 RPM, around 20% throttle, I think, and drop the clutch. I'm on pretty much the baseline setup, except that <laughs> I went for low downfall setting instead of high downfalls, which is the standard. Simply because Spa is a low downfall track. It doesn't feel massively different from from version one. I, I couldn't pinpoint any specific difference.
Right, so that's version 2 of the RSS Formula Hybrid 2022. Now, as I already said in my last video, this is an absolutely fantastic car. It's worth every cent. And as a car, it's just as brilliant as the VRC Formula Alpha 2022. It's amazing what kind of quality mods we're getting these days. It's amazing what's possible in set course in these days. And this is already making me curious to be honest. Well, what RSS are going to do with the Formula Hybrid 2023 because so far with every Formula Hybrid if somehow managed to make it better than the previous one. I'm sure that they will find a way to keep that trend up even next year. Even though it's still quite far till then. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, and you want to see more content like this, be sure to click like and subscribe. So, till next time, use the downforce, and see you soon.